New at 10, the largest city in the valley is trying to capitalize on the phrase all inclusive. Those words could soon be associated not just with parks, but every Brownsville event. CBS 4 Stephen Seeley joins us in the studio. And Stephen, what exactly was the motivation behind this move? Well, the motive is to make all services available to those with special needs. And that's according to City Commissioner Jessica Detro. Brownsville receives many calls asking for officials to increase accessibility throughout the area. She, along with her colleague Cesar De Leon, are asking the commission to vote on creating an all-inclusive coordinator position. The job would oversee all activities, awareness, and other accommodations for those with special needs in the community. Special needs community should be represented at and feel, you know, these families that they have different needs from what ours are. And so I just want the city to cater more and make sure that these children and community members know that Brownsville is an all-inclusive city. The position would be created under the Parks and Rec Department. Commissioner Tetro tells me that the main mission for this position would be creating more opportunities for the special needs community to get involved. Now, the few parents I spoke to are hoping this agenda item gets passed, and it's unclear how much the position will pay or how it will be covered, but the City Commission will discuss the details at their next meeting if they decide to approve it. In the studio with complete Valley coverage, Stephen Seeley, CBS4 Valley, tonight.